one of the questions that's come up a lot is what's the status of those WWE behind the scenes videos that you put out a trailer for that a documentary was coming and then they kind of nothing ever happened. You know, the, the reason nothing ever happened is because I wasn't prepared. I wasn't prepared to, um, at the time, I I don't think it was. I don't think it was time for me to to do that. Then you know, I think it's it's probably a little safer to let it go now because nobody n- nobody hasn't seen. You know, some of this stuff. I will tell you, um, it has some of the most. It has shit. Uh, there, there's never been a movie like it. I'm very proud of it. Um, we'll just have to see what happens with it. But uh, it's truly behind the scene. It's truly a, a behind the scenes movie. Um, and the sad part about the movie is half the people in it are dead. I mean, I've spent all day crying today, finding out friends I I didn't know were dead or were, have passed. And so um, it, it would mean a lot to the wrestling business to see that movie. So I, I'm still wrestling with that. I, I'll tell you, here, here's where I'm at on that. That's important to me. Um, but I'm going to let that wait because I have a couple other projects that need um, that need attention first. I, I think anyway. And we're going to start with those, and those should give you some serious shit to talk about. Now, when you were back there in WWE, did the click uh, get along with you? Because around that time, they had a lot of power backstage. It's funny you would say that, because there is a couple of scenes in the in the movie where I absolutely discuss that extensively. I mean, that that was part of what was happening with me in that movie. And the funny part about this, see, nobody knows this, is I made that movie and I had already been fired. I knew I was done at the end of that tour. And I literally left the WWF. When you finally see that movie, I literally left the WWF with fans chanting in Germany, it was actually Switzerland, in Geneva, Switzerland. I, I walked out of the ring, and my last match for the WWF was with um, the crowd chanting, do it again, to Gaben. It's uh, The Germans are amazing when they – the Europeans, when they start chanting, especially if this is a German phrase, but when they start chanting, to Gaben, to Gaben means do it again, do it again, do it again. That's their way of calling for a uh, encore. So I went back for an encore and played uh, the second song I'd prepared. And then I walked out of the ring and uh, never went back. Did you you get along with The Undertaker behind the scenes? Oh, absolutely. Yeah. Um, Mark's a class act. That's all there is to it. Thank you for watching the Hannibal TV. Please like this video if you enjoyed it and click the subscribe button to not miss any of our latest shoot interviews, match videos, or news updates. Support us on Patreon.com for $1.99 a month to watch our full shoot interviews ad-free and help our channel grow. Follow us on Twitter at The Hannibal TV for instant updates.